Hi ladies and gentlemen, I'm back today with the video I was telling you about. It's going to be a blanket reveal of a new baby. And I'm going to change um, the baby really quick also. And it's a little bit later in the day that I wanted to do it. It's actually the early evening and the baby is sitting, if you can't tell, against this really cute llama stuffed animal. So that's where you're going to halfway see his face. So that's where he's... He kind of helps the baby sit up if need be. So this is just a blanket that I have that I'm going to, it's a little tiny baby. So I'm gonna start showing the baby's feetsies. Here's the baby's feet. So you can see it's a tiny baby. And y'all know that I have quite a few no uh, other babies by this artist. I'll let you know. And there's a little fat tummy. That baby's got a fat tummy. And here's her chest. And I love the outfit that she was sent in. It's got a, it's a onesie, but it's really fancy onesie, as I call it. And it's got a ruffle across the chest there with a little rosette. So we can see the baby's arms. And you can see the baby is a beautiful African-American baby. It's a baby girl. And you can see her arms here. Under the blanket. So we're gonna see her pretty face. Oh, there she is. I'm gonna bring her up to the camera closer. Isn't she beautiful? She is a um, Behringer sculpt. <clears throat> and she has, usually, this Behringer has a hard body, the torso, all, you know, full body, I guess you would call, call her. But she is, her body has been replaced with a cloth body, which I really like it much better because I have some other Behringer's. I know her face is a little shiny. She does have a little bit of shine on her face, but that's okay. She's still a beautiful girl. You can see her up close. Look how beautiful she is. Beautiful brown eyes. Let me show you her hair. There's her painted hair. And if you might not better recognize it, but see her style of painted hair. She is a LaDonna baby by LaDonna Briggs or Sweet Potato Pie Nursery. I have quite a few of her other babies painted by her. This is one of her budget babies. And I have some more of her budget babies. And look at this bonnet that she came with. Can you see that? It's got two brown or ribbon rosettes. And this is her bonnet. It kind of tucks under so you can't see the rosettes as good. But I just wanted to show you that before I take it off because I love this bonnet. This is what she came in. The outfits are going to get her quickly changed today. And I really love how LaDonna um, weighted her. She's 15 inches. I mean, she's kind of scrunched up. She's a tiny one. But her head is really heavy and she's got lots of weight in her bum bum. And it feels like it's loose, which I love because you can squish it with her fingers. It's almost like a little relaxing, like a stress ball, but it's her little hiney. So we're going to let her lean up against, um, I call this stuffed animal Lulu the Llama. So there's Lulu. And she's leaning up against her where she can get um, changed. So we're going to change her quick. And she does not have a diaper on. So I'm going to put a little preemie diaper on. And that's, like I said, I love the way she's weighted. She feels so good to hold. Oh, and it's a little bit tight because she's got a chunky belly. It's kind of tight around her. Yeah. She has that band, like that ruffle. I don't know if that have made that, added that to the outfit or what. But it's really cute. Or if it came like that. I kind of think she might have added it. Because I've seen this onesie before. And it was not, didn't have this around it. So we're going to take her. Oh goodness, it's tight. Like that little band makes it kind of tight. I guess. Yeah, I did it off there, Mama. And her neck is um, like a little flange on there. I thought I made a flange. Because, like I said, originally the bodies, their bodies, their full torso, um, their full body is what I'm trying to say, usually. But I love the soft bodies with her. And she says, I'm going to put my diaper on. I got, you know what? I got to get her a diaper. If you could just excuse me for just a second and have her on diapers on. I can't, she can't go with her diaper. I'm going to get her a diaper. My goodness. And like I said, I will be showing you my nursery tour soon. I just 
have to get some other babies dressed before because I guess they'll be included in the tour because they're all over the place. So I want to finish dressing them and then in the next couple of days I will be showing you. Oh, look at Mama did. I put it on backwards. Look at that Mama today. So we're going to put her diaper on first. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. And I was waiting on this little girl and you know how it is when you're waiting for a baby to arrive in the mail. It seems like that day the mailman's late. The other days he comes early, he comes on time, but anyway, she came. I thought it was a little bit small for her. Actually, she's a big girl. So this is what we're going to put it on her, this little vintage, this little tiny vintage dress. It's got blue smocking on the bottom, it's white, and then we have bows and a bonnet and sockies to go. So I have been working hard, like I said, on totally redecorating, or not, well, I guess it's sort of, it's sort of like redecorating, my um, nursery for my babies. So I've been doing that, and then cleaning, like doing a deep cleaning also. You know how that starts. Once you start deep cleaning the house, then you find another spot you got to clean, another room, and it kind of takes on a life of its own. So that's what I've been doing. That's why I've been, one reason I've been kind of, um a little absent to not making so many videos i wanted to start trying to make a video each day but it doesn't seem like that's working out but i'm gonna try to and we're upcoming this next coming week of a memorial um weekend and starting then we're gonna have a family vacation so i'll be busy doing that for about a week we're just gonna stay around town and what I'll do when I get dresses or clothes that are like, you know, a little bit too big in the neck or whatever, I just cinch them up so I'll get something to cinch it up. Look how pretty she is. See her in her dress? So I'll fix that a little bit later. I'm going to, right after I get off, I'll cinch that dress up so they can fit better. And now we've got these little frilly socks. And I love these because they're actually, you don't hardly ever find preemie socks like this with the ruffles <clears throat> so when I got them I got them actually with another um one of my other LaDonna babies these special frilly socks so she's also a preemie bliss if you remember bliss I still have her I'm gonna do a video soon I'm gonna show all my LaDonna babies oh look her little bonnet so I'm gonna put her white bonnet on all these clothes are vintage as you know I love vintage so whenever I can dress my babies in vintage I will Putting this bonnet on her, and I'm gonna put her little, like, I'm gonna put a little bow on her bonnet. Let's see how that's gonna go. I don't want it to be in her face. Maybe like that. How does that look? Does that look funny? What do you think? There. So I put, I clipped the bon, I clipped the um, blue bow to her bonnet because she does have a little bit of blue in her dress here. So, there she is, and I do not have a name for her yet. If y'all want to help me um, think of a name, that looks funny. Ideally, it would be like right here, but I don't have anything to clip it to, I think. Let's see, right on top of her head. <laughs> That's kind of funny. That's kind of big, but it looks cute. I guess I'll deal with that for right now. I don't know. It's going to bug me until I get it the way I want it. But anyway, I just put the blue. She could be... Bluebell or something. Anyway, so if I can help me think of a name, I would love name suggestions. I want something really cute and sweet for her because she's cute and sweet. She's like a little muffin, my son would say. She's like a little muffin. So if y'all can help me think of a name, feel free to make name suggestions and I will definitely be looking forward to those and take them into account for her name. So just let me know. Hope y'all like this beautiful little girl. And, like I said, she does have a little bit of shininess to her. Um, but if you would like to um, go to, well, it's I can't remember LaDonna's page. She does sell babies, budget babies. She's a budget baby. And I, and really, one of the things I admire about LaDonna is she sells budget babies. She's like a really pretty famous artist, as y'all know. But she still sells budget babies so everybody can afford one of her babies and beautiful babies. So... 
if you just type in to eBay, if you type in LaDonna Briggs, um, Reborn Baby, or, um, yeah, you, it will come up, her babies that she has for sale. And I got her real quick. She had a boy, like one that looked more like a boy, an African American one up. So she might still have that one up because it didn't sell. And she does have some other ones um, for a regional pie, a little bit more, but they're still considered budget babies. are right under $200. But she was about $50 or $60. So she was a really special baby girl. So if y'all have a name suggestion, please let me know. And we're going to go. We're going to go. Let me put her up to the camera so you can say bye. Oh, look, that looks better. So, Molly, why didn't you have me up in the camera like that so everybody could see me? See, I look so cute. You got to show everybody. Up close. So there she is up close. She's a beautiful girl. By the Donna Briggs Sweet Potato Pie Nursery. So please give me name suggestions. I would love to see y'all's name suggestions. Sometimes it takes me a while to choose a name because I like the perfect name. Probably like you're all a name that really the baby really looks like. You know what I mean. So I do want something sweet and cute for her because she's a sweetie pie. She really is. Yeah. Anyway. Please um, give me name suggestions or any any comments. I enjoy all your comments, really. So if you'd like to comment about something else, please do. And I will talk to you soon. And this little sweetheart says, says bye. She says bye. She blow kisses. Mwah. Blow kisses. She's blowing kisses. I'll talk to our aunties and uncles. And I will talk to you very soon. And I will be back hopefully next couple days with an actual um, nursery tour. And I may have to do, break that into two videos. We'll see. I want to show you the tour of the um, nursery and also you'll be seeing my babies are all in nursery now so you'll get to see all my babies my, and it's a quite a num good group of babies number of babies so you'll see so I'll talk to you soon stay safe and stay blessed and I appreciate each and every one of you and I will be back in the next couple days see you soon